Hi, I'm Damon Smith, Extension Field Crop Specialist for the University of Wisconsin-Madison. And today I'd like to introduce you to a new smartphone application for both the Android and iPhone platforms. And this uh, new app is called Sporecaster. And Sporecaster is a white mold forecasting system for soybean. Once you download Sporecaster, you'll actually start uh, the app and you'll come to this initial home screen. This home screen has a couple of options. However, to generate a forecast the first time, you'll actually need to set a new field. To do that, we'll click on the New Field tab and we'll actually set a forecast for the Arlington Ag Agricultural Research Station where we do a lot of our white mold work. So we'll call this AARS for the Arlington Ag Research Station. And then we also need to set our row spacing, which at this particular location is, is 30 inch, and we have no irrigation at this particular location. Now you can set the actual GPS coordinates a couple of ways. You can either use the Google embedded Google map here and move around, or if you know the GPS coordinates, you can actually simply uh, paste those into this or enter them directly into the field location system. Once you've done that, you can hit done, and now that field is saved in your history for the remainder of the season or for the, for the entirety of this particular app. So you could actually come back in future years and run uh, similar forecasts if you uh, have saved it in this particular uh, system. Now to actually generate a forecast, it'll bring you to this particular screen. We have to answer a couple of pieces of information, and we'll actually cheat today. We'll tell it that we actually do have flowers present, and then we also have to tell it whether the rows are over a certain threshold in terms of coverage. And to understand what that over or under threshold is, you can hit the information button uh, or click on the uh, pictures here and look at what's uh, over or under threshold. So under threshold and the above, um, we, anything at this threshold or less would be under, and then over threshold would be anything in the lower um, uh, image that's either at that threshold or, or more. Once we understand what our row closure thresholds are, we'll actually choose over for this particular demonstration. We'll use today's date and we'll hit run model. So we actually produced a forecast here that tells it we're at high risk, and if soybeans were in the field and met these criteria, then a fungicide application would be recommended uh, based on this particular information. Now be aware if you, uh, if you run this uh, and you cheat, in other words, if there aren't flowers uh, present and the rows are not uh, over threshold, you can actually produce a nonsensical uh, forecast. So this is a tool, bear that in mind, you have to answer these questions correctly. So for instance, we can go back, we can set a, a new uh, forecast for no flowers, uh, and then say under threshold, try to run the model, and you'll see the model is inactive at this point because we haven't met those other criteria. An additional feature of this app is the ability to email this, these forecasts to yourself or to a client. When you choose this option, there's actually an Excel sheet that's embedded within the email. And in that Excel sheet, you can find all the field history uh, for that particular location. This will be useful for you to save that information in multiple locations. If you need more information about Sporecaster, feel free to contact us. If you also need information about how to manage white mold, feel free to contact us or contact your local extension agent.